Hey guys, this is it. This is the channel update. Changes are coming video that I have been teasing out before I jump in. I want to start by first thanking so many of you who have been hearing my my pleas for, um, you know, it's been rough. It's been rough. I'm not the only one. I know it. A lot of channels are struggling with some shifts in the algorithm. Um, <clears throat> but, you know, a lot of you have certainly circled the wagons and been supportive and a handful of you have been showing up in all the videos and liking and commenting and throwing up emojis and going into the playlists and spending all your evenings and free time supporting me. And uh, what like a life raft that has been because I have been feeling very lost at sea for some time. So I want to thank you. I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Um, for those of you who have been showing up and some of you have even been emailing with me your ideas, your thoughts, what you've seen other channels doing. It's all been so helpful. Um, and, and you know, I've, I've had to, I've applied some things and other things. I've explained what isn't going to work and why. Um, but at any rate, just the back and forth has been great because I am a brainstormer at heart. I love that. So I want to thank those of you ha who have taken the time you know, your own time to be a part of um, this community that, you know, that we're creating and to see it grow and thrive is what I'm all about. And to have those of you who have invested yourselves in it really means the world to me. So I wanted to start with a big fat thank you for those of you who have been invested in that. Regardless... <laughs> hasn't moved the needle a whole lot. So um, I'm going to take my own, you know, like I'm going to practice what I preach. It's a full moon in Aries and I didn't get any damn sleep last night. You can see my bags are designer here. And um, so, right, who can sleep with a full moon? But this super full moon is killing me. And it's in Aries, which is cardinal energy, startup energy. Get off your ass, Laura. Make some changes. Let some shit go. It's time. And like I said in the reading that I did, uh, which it's not too late. Oh, by the way, it's five o'clock somewhere. So pardon me. Um, yeah, this full moon is a big release one. And of course, it's mostly about relationships. It's on the Aries Libra axis. But I'm in relationship with all of you. And I feel this relationship is flatlining because I can't serve you if the algorithm won't let me, okay? If it won't let me grow, I can't stay in this relationship. So that's the metaphor. So here are the changes that I feel will be most proactive. Um, I'm gonna thank Julia, you know who you are. She spoke about ads. She doesn't see them. That's probably a, an international thing I'm thinking maybe. I don't know. It could be. But um, I have made a habit of placing only one ad on each video somewhere in the middle in a place where I'm shuffling. Um, I'm not, I mean, I don't even make, like maybe I make $200 a month in ad revenue. So I don't even really, that's not a big thing. But her point was that, and it's a good one, that YouTube is not seeing me as a moneymaker. So I am going to let them place my ads. So I'm not going to override YouTube anymore on ad placements. So one of the big changes is you're going to see a lot more ads. That's going to be annoying AF. I understand Please don't nasty gram me in the comments. It's going to be really annoying. My request is that you skip ads that are that are 2 minutes or that are longer than 2 minutes and just let 2 minutes or less let them run. Here's why. It helps me a little bit cuz maybe I'll make more than $200 for the month and I can pay my cable bill. That would be helpful. It will also show YouTube 
that I can be a moneymaker for them. Light bulb moment, guys. So I don't think my, re my videos are long enough that they place five, but they might place three. And if one of them is four minutes, you skip that. And if two of them are two minutes, you let them run. Thank you in advance. So that's one thing. Here's the big thing. Um, the order will be changing. And let me explain why. I have four high performing zodiac signs. They are um, Gemini, Leo, Virgo, and Pisces. Gemini is newer to that club, vacillates between Gemini and Libra. But of my air signs, Gemini right now is hotter than the others. Leo has always been high performing, Virgo has always been high performing, Pisces has always been high performing. So those are my four top for each of the elements, right? Fire, earth, air, water is what I mean by that. So those signs, those four signs are going to get three readings per month and they're going to be interspersed with the other eight signs, which are lower performing. So in other words, I'm not going to do Aries, Taurus, uh, Gemini, Cancer, etc. It's going to go Aries, Leo, then Taurus, Virgo. See what I'm doing here? Then Gemini, and that's already a top performer, then Cancer, then Pisces. So after a lower performing zodiac sign like Aries, I'm going to come in with a hot one like Leo. So what I'm doing essentially is effing with the algorithm so it doesn't have a time to flatline me. Because if I go from Aries straight to Taurus, I've got two days in a row where there's not a lot of activity, where, where I'm getting messages from on, in my dashboard that my videos aren't performing. It tells me that. I'm literally like flatlining it because it looks literally like a heart monitor. So what I'm doing here, guys, is I'm taking those shock paddles to my channel and I'm putting it down. I'm trying to get it to pop up so that the algorithm says, oh, Awakened Priestess has a heartbeat. We have a heartbeat. We have life here. We're going to show her to other people. Oh, and they're watching the ads now. We have life. So please understand, it's going to be a little bumpy for you because it's not, it's not going to be what you're used to. It's going to be out of your comfort zone. Okay? I understand that. It's going to be out of mind too. I'm a Virgo, guys. You got to understand that I'm used to my system, but I'm also a mutable sign and I got, I got to roll with the changes and this is what I've come up with. I think it's pretty creative, quite frankly. Um, and it might take a few cycles. It might take like 90 days before we see the results, before we get any kind of real signs of what it does, if anything. So um, that's my biggest change. The ads are, is another change. Um, and so for those of you who have renewing memberships in those eight signs that are lower performing, and let me read those out to you. If you have Aries, Taurus, Cancer, Libra, Scorpio, Sagittarius, Capricorn, or Aquarius, and you are in the monthly membership, your renewals are going to be cut in half. So instead of 1111, it will be 555. For as long as you're only getting one extended, you're still getting the new moon reading, the full moon reading, and the monthly energy update, but unless or until you get back to getting your two zodiac readings, your membership is 555. I think that's fair, more than fair, because you're still getting four extendeds for $5.55. So that is my solution to that problem, but I know that this change in the order is going to rock some of you 
and maybe cause a mass exodus. I don't know. Um, I'm going to do the best I can. If um, any of you have a suggestion for how to calm any mass hysteria about this, please email. Don't put it in the comments because I'm not going to post it. Email it to me at Awakened Priestess the name of the channel, at gmail.com. And I'll be happy to take it into consideration. Okay? So it's, for example, my thought is I could keep it as a pinned comment of what the order is. So that at each video, the pinned comment is the order. For the week or for the month or, right? Um, I usually like to pin a comment that says something wonderful about the video, but maybe it would be better to serve all of you just to pin the order for a while. So that's one thought. Um, but if you have a better idea, email it to me. Okay. So that's it. That's what I got. And, um, I hope that you find it as a creative a solution as I do and um, that you send me all kinds of good energy. Let's keep this thing going. Let's show that algorithm that we are smarter than it is. Here's to you, full moon blessings to all. Bye for now.